Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at ND filters for the DJI Mavic Pro. I've purchased the newer ND filters for my Mavic Pro and uh, let's talk just a briefly here why we want ND filters. Uh, what an ND filter is, is basically a, a pair of sunglasses for your drone. Um, so what we're trying to do is we're trying to uh, get our shutter speed down to double our frames per second. Uh, so in this particular video, we're shooting at 30 frames per second. So we're going to try to get our shutter speed to 60 frames per second. And on a cloudy day or, a, or definitely on a sunny day, you're going to find that you are way overexposed if you don't have some type of ND filter. Uh, and that's going to make it tough to catch those cinematic shots that uh, uh, you're seeing on uh, YouTube and TV and everywhere else. Um, so what you want to do uh, is buy yourself a set of ND filters. Uh, this kit came with the 4, 8, 16, and 32. And uh, you're going to adjust the uh, ND filter that you use to um, make sure you're not overexposed with your shutter speed set to 60. Now, if you guys are taking a look at the screen here, you're going to notice the white and black lines on the screen. Uh, that's an overexposure warning. Uh, it's a setting that they have in the DJI uh, software, and I like having that on so I can tell whether or not I'm overexposed. Uh, it is very difficult to fix an overexposed video. So just a quick look at the settings here on the screen. Uh, ISO 100, shutter, shutter speed will be uh, flipped down to 60. And uh, go ahead and fix your uh, custom uh, white balance to a number that looks good. Uh, I uh, recommend doing that so you have a consistent color throughout the entire video. Uh, so without any further ado, guys, let's go ahead and hop up in the air and take a side-by-side. -side. We got an ND4 on top and an ND16 on the bottom. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Be sure to click the subscribe button if this was helpful and leave a comment below.